then every day last week it announced emergency lending programs it pledged to spend at least seven hundred billion dollars supporting mortgages banks money market mutual funds corporate bonds and lending to central banks of other countries because the dollar is the currency of world trade we are being very aggressive and i think our chairman jay powell has learned from the experience of 2008 we're moving much faster than we moved in 2008 we're being more aggressive is there more we can do yes is there more we may end up doing yes but i think we're being very aggressive and i i think that's the right thing can you characterize everything that the fed has done this past week as essentially flooding the system with money yes exactly and there's no end to your ability to do that there is no end to our ability to do that what did we learn from 2008 when you were in the Treasury Department and how is that being applied today there are two big mistakes when I look back at 2008 that we made that I think are relevant today number one we were always too slow and too timid in responding to the crisis the reason is we didn't know how bad it was going to get and we didn't want to overreact and it turned out it got really, really bad. And the right answer should have been overreacting to try to avoid the devastating recession that we ended up happening. So today, whether it's healthcare policymakers, fiscal policymakers, which means Congress or the Federal Reserve, we are erring on the side of overreacting to try to avoid the worst economic outcomes. And number two,